American employers added more workers than forecast in October and a rush of people entering the labor force pushed the jobless rate higher, according to the last report on the labor market before next week's presidential election. Broad-based gains in employment, from car dealers and hospitals to factories and construction sites, indicate consumers are likely to spend more freely and shore up the three-year expansion in the face of a global economic slowdown and political gridlock in Washington over taxes and spending. Hiring increased by 171,000 workers after a 148,000 gain in thank you for trying verbose. This recording will go away once the product has been purchased. September that was bigger than first estimated. Labor Department figures showed today in Washington. October's increase exceeded the most optimistic forecast in a Bloomberg survey with a median projection of a 125,000 gain. Unemployment rose to 7.9 percent. Jobs are expanding despite all this expression of business caution, said Mari Harris, chief economist at UBS Securities LLZ in New York. You continue to see improvements in people's perceptions of what's happening in the job market. Private payrolls, which exclude government agencies, climbed by 184,000 last month, the most since February. They were forecast to thank you for trying verbose. This recording will go away once the product has been purchased advance by 123,000. Stocks fell, erasing early gains, as the payrolls data failed to keep technology and oil producers from slumping. The Standard & Poor's 500 index declined 0.1% to 1,425.92 at 12 p.m. in New York. The yield on the benchmark 10-year Treasury note increased to 1.74% from 1.73% late yesterday. Upward revisions revisions added the total of 84,000 jobs to the employment count in the previous two months and brought average gains since June to 173,000. Government payrolls decreased by 13,000. Retailers took on 36,400. Thank you for trying verbose. This recording will go away once the product has been purchased. Employees, the most since April 2011. Temporary hiring rose by 13,600. One of those newly employed, Michaela Padilla.